Virtualization can increase flexibility, lower total cost of ownership, reduce downtime, and improve efficiency. But did you know that you can more than double your energy savings by tackling the power, cooling, and management challenges that come with virtualization? Three of the most common challenges are decreased efficiency, inadequate cooling, and capacity management. For instance, did you know that virtualization can actually worsen your PUE? Here's why. Virtualization reduces IT loads, leaving existing power and cooling infrastructure oversized. This can degrade your PUE significantly and may lead to disappointment in how much or how little your energy consumption is reduced, but it also presents opportunity. By right-sizing your power and cooling to the new, lower IT loads, you can increase your efficiency and further decrease operating costs. One way to do this is by adopting a modular architecture that scales to the dynamic loads of a virtualized environment. Take UPSs, for example. Highly efficient, modular UPSs provide an effective power solution. Hot swappable, scalable, and less expensive to maintain. Modular UPSs allow you to add right size capacity or redundancy on the fly, making them ideal for virtualization. Some high efficiency models have 70% less loss than legacy UPSs at typical loads. Modular, row-based cooling can help too. It efficiently captures heat as it leaves the racks and delivers cool air to the servers. What makes this cooling ideal for virtualized environments is that it accommodates both low and high densities by automatically adjusting fan speeds to closely align with your cooling needs. Using right size power and cooling addresses many of the efficiency challenges of virtualization, though not all. That's where Data Center Infrastructure Management or DCIM software can help. With multiple virtual machines and applications running on any single host, the health and availability for each physical machine are critical. DCIM tools can ensure that adequate power and cooling are available for each machine. Virtualization also presents intense and constantly changing power and cooling requirements. Dynamic loads that can't be responded to manually. By communicating with a VM manager, DCI tools can initiate the automated movement of virtual machines if problems arise in the power and cooling infrastructure. DCIM can also ensure the VM manager only creates or moves VMs to racks with sufficient power and cooling resources. On the energy front, DCIM tools measure, monitor, automated, optimized processes for energy efficiency, like initiating load shifts to save energy, maximize existing capacity, and measure PUE. DCIM tools can also help you with planning by monitoring the locations of virtual machines and their physical hosts, and by monitoring the utilization of physical servers. DCIM tools can even tell you where to install your next server and model what-if scenarios to verify current capacity and design. Consolidating IT equipment through virtualization can save money, space, and time. By using these four methods to implement the right power, cooling, and management solutions, you can ensure your organization will maximize virtualization benefits and avoid unintentionally degrading your PUE. To see how making infrastructure improvements would affect your data center, try our virtualization energy cost calculator at tools.apc.com. To learn more, visit whitepapers.apc.com and download white paper number 118 on virtualization and cloud computing.